be a player. I don't want to be a player no more. I'm not a player, I just fought a lot. But me and Punisher still got what you're looking for. For my thug niggas, for my thug niggas. I'm not a player, I just fought a lot. Girl, this is your sign to go get some clip-ins that match your hair length. And I got these from Curls Queen. Y'all already know. Shout out to them for sponsoring this video. Um, so I got two bundles of the 18 inch water jerry curl. I think that's what they call. And um, yeah, friends, like these are some really good high quality clip-ins. Every, every girl I feel like needs a good pair of clip-ins in her drawer. Like so quick and easy. So first thing I'm going to do is a simple wash and go. Uh, not too much on this combo. The combo kind of... I'm not going to say it was mid, friends, but, like, just not for this, you know. Um, I would definitely use something cream-based uh, to for, like, like a clip-in wash ago. Um, this had way too much slip. It was way too wet. Um, it didn't dry in a good enough time. Anyway, look at the match. Wow. After I put that foam on there, I went in and put some gel just to define my curls a little bit. And of course, I'm using the Pattern Beauty Shower Brush. And my hair is nice and shiny and defined. I'm combing the hell out of these clippings, y'all. And it look rough, but these some real durable, high quality clippings. Ain't no shedding. You know, good clippings. I put some gel in them. And I'm sweating. I'm hot. I'm burning up. Come back. Let my hair dry. First hairstyle. This flip over method, okay? So we're starting off with that defined wash and go. The match is literally insane. Look at it. I mean, the colors is off, but that's my fault. My hair turning brown, which I don't know why it's doing that. But anyway, so to lay these clip-ins, I'm going to um, basically just measure the clip-in and I'm going to lay it in like a um, sew-in pattern, kind of. So just like a uh, part track, part track part track like you know just like that and it's it I, I don't know for some reason it never dawned on me like to get clip-ins that matched my hair length because I don't know I feel like we always just kind of went for length instead of volume but like the volume baby eats down and there's no line of demarcation so like if you can honestly go for volume and so I'm just placing these kind of in like a U shape around my head. Leaving the front out and defining those curls as I go. Sometimes I'm using like the wefts with two tracks. Sometimes I mean with two clips. Sometimes I'm using the wefts with four clips. It just depends on the space that I'm trying to fill. Because you want to know something, friends, with the clip-ins that are for the length, you got to do a whole braid down. I mean, these are literally just so quick and easy, friends. I mean, like, I mean, you can't really beat this. So, I'm going to go ahead and um slick this part out. I would call it my leave out, but every all of my hair is left out. It's not really leave out. And I absolutely love that for me. Love, love, love. And define my baby hairs, slick down my edges, and that, that is look number one. I mean, really, seriously, so cute. Like, I'm obsessed. Seriously. You can't even tell. All right, look number two. This is my favorite look, y'all. This little half up, half down, she's super cute. I'm just going to sp split my hair, <laughs> part my hair down the middle, take those two sections, um, tie them together in the back, and then I'm going to... Place the wefts, boom, 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 um, in the back. And then uh, just take out that top portion, blend it down, pull out those two side pieces, put the middle in a ponytail, do my edges, and then we're done. Super cute. You're probably going to have to wash that back a couple times to get that. I'm not going to lie. But it, it it's really simple. <laughs> so the third hairstyle is this super cute I don't know this is kind of giving a little sizzle to me like I don't know this is like what I feel like is on every natural girl's you know Pinterest board um the layout for this was a little bit tricky but I just end up doing it like the same way I would do a traditional like sew in like how you would sew your hair in um but instead there's a triangle in the front and I just left the triangle out 
and then um i diffused my hair and uh that was it you know of course i had to play around with it to make sure everything blended properly and everything was sitting properly but yeah after that it was super cute i love all of these hairstyles for the summer definitely going to keep these clip-ins on me at all times if you guys want to get your own clip-ins everything at in it is going to be in the description bar god damn see y'all next see y'all later <laughs>